Welcome to a short how-to video that will cover the basics of the Snap Signal configuration software from Banner Engineering. To begin, connect a compatible Modbus sensor or S15C converter to a Windows PC using the RS-485 to USB adapter cable and by following the diagram in the manual. The manual can be found by navigating to the Help menu and clicking on Documentation. In this example, we will be connecting an S15S-T-MQ temperature sensor. Click Connect and then select the COM port to which the device is connected. If you're not sure which port to select, disconnect the USB cable and hit the refresh icon. The COM port that disappears is the one you will need to select. Click Find to load the sensor's information and click Submit. The Device Configuration section is where you can choose basic communication settings. The most important field is the SID or Server ID. A unique SID must be set for each device that will be in a server chain and it can be set to any value between 1 and 247. You can also choose a custom user tag which allows you to label the device with identifying information such as the product type, location, or any other helpful information. When you have finished configuring the device information, click Write to save the settings. The Live Demo section allows you to pull real-time measurement data from the device. Select the data parameter you wish to pull from the drop-down menu and click Start Polling. The graph will continually update with the data in real-time until you click Stop Polling. The All Signals section provides momentary values of all available measurement registers as well as any internal data provided by the device, such as internal temperatures. To update the signal values, click the Read icon. That covers the basics of the Snap Signal configuration software. For more information, visit BannerEngineering.com.